ஹலோ எவ்ரி ஒன் வணக்கம் அண்ட் வெல்கம் டு மீட்டியர் அகாடமி ஒன் ஆஃப் த லீடிங் அகாடமி இன் ட்ரைனிங் நர்சஸ் இன் தர் காம்பிடேட்டிவ் எக்ஸாம் ஐஎல்ஸ் ஓஇடி ட்ரைனிங் ஆஸ் வெல் ஆஸ் அப்ராட் நர்சிங் பிளேஸ்மெண்ட் சர்வீசஸ் அண்ட் டுடே வி ஆர் கோயிங் டு டிஸ்கஸ் அபவுட் எய்ம்ஸ் நார்ஸ் அட் டூ தௌசண்ட் டுவெண்ட்டி டூ சால்வ்டு கொஸ்டின் பேப்பர் பார்ட் டூ இஃப் யூ வாண்ட் டு செக் பார்ட் ஒன் ப்ளீஸ் கோ டு த சேனல் அண்ட் செக் இட் அவுட் அண்ட் ஒன் மோர் இம்பார்ட்டன் நியூஸ் கைஸ் This is exclusively for Tamil Nadu nursing candidates who are applying for nursing competitive exam. Yes guys, we meet a team in future going to post videos that is YouTube videos in bilingual language that is in Tamil as well as in English so that it will be very useful for Tamil Nadu nursing candidates to understand the questions very easily. So what you supposed to do is please subscribe our channel. So let's begin the session if you like the video please like it share it subscribe it and don't forget to click on the bell icon identify the missing column the option given here are hyderabad mumbai delhi rajasthan two images are given here for one image they have given the answer that is kolkata night riders if you are very familiar in keep seeing t20 cricket matches it will be easy for you to answer this question the second image they have given a eagle image This eagle image denotes which cricket team and here the correct answer is option A Hyderabad Postpartum insertion of intrauterine device should be initiated within how many hours this is the question and they have given four options after delivery of the baby within 24 hours within 12 hours within 48 hours within 72 hours So this is a direct question and here the right answer is after delivery of the baby within 48 hours that is option C is the right one In a patient lumbar puncture procedure is going on on duty nursing officer should provide which position to the patient to facilitate this procedure it is a simple and direct question Options given here are patient leg flexed knees are touched on their abdomen and head flexed with chin touched on chest patient lying on back and turned forward patient leg extended knees touched on abdomen and head is extended position extended patient lying inside head turned to one side here yeah, the right answer is option A patient leg flexed knees are touched on abdomen and head flexed with chin touched on chest in simple words we can say knee chest position after lumbar puncture which position should provide to the client to prevent leakage of csf here we received three options that is supine lateral trendenberg if you know the fourth option please let me know and here the right answer is option a supine position so after the lumbar puncture as a nursing officer we are supposed to provide supine position to the patient next image based question identify the following clinical image in the diagram option given here are infection cellulitis gangrene it is very easy and simple question and here the right answer is option c gangrene A 19 month baby visited to pediatric clinic with his parents. On the examination, which clinical finding is normal? And here they have given four option that is anterior fontanel is closed and posterior fontanel is opened. Second option is closed anterior and posterior fontanel. Third, open anterior and posterior fontanel. Fourth, anterior fontanel sunken dense and posterior fontanel is closed. so these are all the four options and as we all know that the anterior fontanels it will be closed in one and a half years that is in 18 months and the posterior fontanel it will be closed in 6 to 12 weeks after the delivery of the baby so by knowing this option we can choose directly the correct answer is option b that is closed anterior and posterior fontanels The anterior fontanel will be closed within one and a half years, and posterior fontanel will be closed within one and a half months. And other key points are anterior fontanels, bregma, posterior fontanels, lambda. Based upon their shape, they have given this name. Anterior fontanel is large diamond shape, and posterior is small triangular shape. anterior fontanel situated at the junction of the sagittal coronal and frontal sutures whereas the posterior fontanels they are situated in the junction of lambdoidal suture 
As I mentioned already, anterior frontal closes at 18 months, whereas posterior closed at 6 to 12 weeks. And it is present anterior frontal present in soft membrane floor and posterior frontal present in bony floor. A patient is diagnosed with right pneumothorax, which clinical findings suggest to this diagnosis. And here we received only two options that is absent of breath sounds on right side, strider on expiration. And among these two, the right answer is option A that is absent of breath sound on the right side. The patient is diagnosed with left sided heart failure. Which of the following data suggests to this diagnosis? Option given here are sacral edema and nocturnal dyspnea. If you come to know the other options, please let me know. And here the right answer is nocturnal dyspnea. The heart failure, it is broadly classified into right side heart failure and left side heart failure. In case of right side heart failure, you know, superior vena cava and inferior vena cava, there is going to be a congestion and stagnation of the blood which will turn into congestion of the peripheral tissues. It will further leads to liver congestion, GI tract congestion and edema, dependent edema and ascites will be there. On the other hand, left side heart failure, it will cause decreased cardiac output and pulmonary congestion. Because of decreased cardiac output, what will happen? Activity intraoral because there is no energy, the oxygen nutrition is not pumped to all tissues or cells. So activity intolerance will be there. And also because of pulmonary congestion, pulmonary edema, impaired gas exchange will be there because of impaired gas exchange, cyanosis, because of pulmonary edema, paroxysmal, nocturnal, dyspnea, orthopenia, these problems will be existing for the patient. So because of these options, we have selected what nocturnal dyspnea for left side heart failure. Which electrolyte imbalance is associated with loop diuretics? Hyperkalemia, hypokalemia, hypernatremia, hypervolemia. It is a direct question if you are administering loop diuretic what will happen to the patient and here the right answer is option b hypokalemia not only hypokalemia administration of loop diuretics will also cause ototoxicity dehydration allergy nephritis as well as gout by the use of valet's rule of nine which parameter can be calculated in a burns patient and the option given here are percentage of depth of burns, percentage of total body surface area, percentage of required fluids in initial phase of the treatment. And it is a direct question. Everyone knows about the rule of 9 and it is introduced by Valais. So it is called as Valais rule of 9. And here the right answer is option B that is percentage of total body surface area. In the childhood immunization, nowadays in DPT vaccine, which vaccine is removed due to its occurrence of large number of side effects? Tetanus, diphtheria, pertussis, all of the above. Nowadays in DPT vaccine, one vaccine is removed among these three. So which is that? And here the right answer is option C that is pertussis. Mrs. Babita is not being able to get pregnant despite having frequent unprotected sex for a at least a year visited to the clinic with her husband after initial examination doctor asked to her husband about childhood history which among the following finding will cause infertility in this couple. Three options we got that is measles, mumps and tetanus. As we all know mumps it will cause orchitis. It may cause sterility. So here the right answer is option B, mumps. Human papilloma virus vaccine schedule in the adolescent girl is four option given here, three doses in 0 to 6 months interval, three doses in 0 1 6 months interval, two doses in 0 6 months interval, two doses in 1 6 months interval, all these interval for less than 15 years of age group. And here the right answer is option A, 3 doses in 0 to 6 months interval. Which of the following additives used in glucose vial in laboratories? Glucose vial in the sense it is coming in grey color container or grey color vial. And in that vial we used to collect all different type of glucose blood samples. For example, OGTT, fasting, postprandial, uh, random blood sugar, everything we supposed to collect in this grey color vial. 
and this gray color vial consists of which among the following additives that is sodium chloride sodium bicarbonate and sodium fluoride and here the right answer is option c sodium fluoride which of the following vaccine firstly should be given soon after the birth firstly underline the word firstly okay option given here are bcg hepatitis b and opv among these three all these vaccine has to be given immediately after the birth but which one has to be given first and here the right answer is option b hepatitis b see hepatitis b has to be given within 24 hours to the baby to prevent vertical transmission whereas if you go to bcg 0.05 ml we can give at birth or 0.1 ml after one month or till one year or up to one year we can give the bcg whereas opv vaccine within 15 days of birth we supposed to give the opv vaccine so within 15 days we can give opv vaccine within 24 hours we can give hepatitis b within one year or up to one year we can give what bcg so among these three which is the immediate one we supposed to administer to the baby hepatitis b so option b is the right one which of the following findings suggest to worsening condition of dengue options are abdominal pain vomiting high grade fever all of the above and here the right answer is option d all of the above the rational is dengue fever also called as breakbone fever it is a viral infection transmitted to human through the bite of an infected mosquitoes the primary vector that transmit the disease are Aedes aegypti mosquito that is the primary vector and the lesser extent the least causative vector is Aedes albopictus. Seven warning signs of dengue fever that is already we know that severe high grade fever apart from that abdominal pain, persistent vomiting, mucosal bleeding and uh, uh, accumulation of fluid that is ascites, lethargy and liver enlargement etc. Which of the following disease is caused by rat flea? Options are Rocky Mountain Spotted Fever, Sleeping Sickness, Epidemic Typers, Endemic Typers. We should know the rational of each and every option in order to solve this question. They are asking about the following disease is caused by rat flea. See the Rocky Mountain Spotted Fever, it is a bacterial infection transmitted by tick and sleeping sickness it is caused by parasite that is triposomnia brucei found in sub-saharan africa and epidemic typus it is a sudden increase in the cases epidemic means sudden increase in the cases spreading to the large population whereas endemic typus endemic in the sense continuously present but limited in the particular region and as you all know, typus, it is a disease caused by rickettsia. We can get it from mites, fleas, lice. This typus is also called as low spawn typus. So based on these rationals, we are coming to the conclusion that option D, it is a right answer that is endemic typus. Which of the following type of bandage used in ankle injury? Reverse spiral, figure of 8 bandage. If you know the other two options, please let me know. And here the right answer is option B, figure of 8 bandage. This figure of 8 bandage commonly used in the joints. That is ankle, elbow, knee joint, even in the wrist joint, we can use the figure of 8 bandage. A patient developed pernicious anemia after total gastrectomy surgery. Which of the following would be prescribed to prevent complication in this patient? Lifelong administration of intrinsic factor, lifelong administration of vitamin B12 for every month. So as we know that total gastrectomy surgery means total removal of the stomach. Inside the stomach, you know, the intrinsic factor is there which is responsible for vitamin B12 absorption. Whereas here, in total gastrectomy, the stomach is removed, there is no intrinsic factor, so vitamin B12 absorption will not be there. So what we supposed to do? They are supposed to administer vitamin B12 for every month in order to maintain the B12 level in the body. An average size egg have which of the following nutrient? 6 gram fat, 6 gram protein, vitamins. 
and here the right answer is option B 6 gram protein a normal average size head have calories up to 67.5 to 68 fat 4.5 to 5 grams iron 0 0.9 calcium 24 to 25 milligrams and protein 6 grams in a patient tetany like spasm is seen which are caused by due to imbalance of which electrolyte hypokalemia hypocalcemia hypercalcemia hyponatremia easy question and here the right answer is option b that is hypocalcemia decreased level of calcium will cause tetany in blood transfusion which number of cannula is used 18 gauge 20 gauge 22 gauge 24 gauge and it is a direct question for blood transfusion we supposed to use 18 gauge the following article should be sterilized by autoclave uv radiation formalin and it is a, a micro drip set and usually this kind of reusable micro drip set has to be sterilized by using uv radiation which of the following cannula is used for children for IV fluid infusion? 22 gauge that is 1 and a half inch long needle, 20 gauge that is 1 and a half inch long needle, 25 gauge 5 by 8 inch long needle, 18 gauge with 1 and a half inch long needle. For children's IV fluids has to be infused through the cannula that is option A 22 gauge with 1.5 inches long needle. So guys I am ending the session now. As I mentioned already, we are going to provide a separate Tamil language YouTube session from October onwards. Please subscribe the channel more and more. Please share this information to your friends so that uh, everyone will get use on it. Okay. And if you want to contact us, please contact in the phone number and address given here. And if you like this video, please like it, share it, subscribe it and don't forget to click on the bell icon. If you want to watch all the videos, whatever we have posted till date, please go to the channel and watch it out. Thank you very much.